Okay, Michelle writes, question, a lot of chaos in his life with a controlling ex and four children uh, around made me pull away a year ago. Do I give him another chance now that he's resolved his issues? Do I trust him? Well, first off, you know, the old narrative, trust is earned. So my question to you, is what is he going to do different or what are the two of you gonna go different? So here's what I recommend, Michelle. Purchase the book, Eight Dates. Start reading it with him before you guys, before the penis gets to go back into the vagina on a regular basis. Read this book over an eight week period and then see if it's worth investing in him. That would be my suggestion. Oh my God, eight weeks, Jonathan. I gotta wait eight weeks to have sex? Ladies. If you're going to spend the rest of your life with someone, why aren't you doing a better job vetting to see if he wants to spend the rest of his life with you? And so by asking better questions, you have an opportunity. In my coaching practice, I, I got to tell you, I love how well my coaching practice is received, my private coaching practice. And I share this with you because I help you form, personally help you form the right questions to ask based on who you are and what you're looking for in a relationship. Because most of you women date in the clouds. You're in the clouds. You're like in the fairy tale land. This whole men are chivalrous and they're going to claim you and you just sit back in your feminine. It's just princess energy and it's all going to work out like magic. What fucking planet are these people living on? You know, I get it. There is a small percentage that this happens. I get it. Okay. It's a small percentage. But you know what? Have they really proved? Yeah, a lot of people got into relationship through this methodology. But have they proved that can make it work in the long run? Dysfunctional people can fall madly in love with each other and absolutely kill each other in a short period of time. So do the work and you have a greater chance for success. At least that's my invitation for you. Michelle, thank you for your question. I really appreciate it. 